Hey, what's up guys? Lyndon here from Opat3 and today I'm going to be showing you how, showing you guys how to bring contacts into your HubSpot CRM via using the business card scanner feature within the application. What happens when a customer gives you a business card, right? And they, you know, you want to get this business card um, straight into your CRM. Now what normally happens with your business card is that you get business cards and the business cards come out looking all bulky and messed up and they stay somewhere stacked up on your desk and they're just there collecting dust. But there's a really, really easy way that you have the ability now of taking that information from your business card and using the business card scanner feature on the HubSpot CRM app and importing it. And I'm going to show you guys that right now. So guys, one of the first things that you want to do is get your, open your app. And as you open your app, and the app is also available on both Android and also iOS, um, you will go across to where it says more. And when you go across to where it says more, you will notice that it says business card scanner. When you go to business card scanner, right, all that you need to do is have where your, your card is. So you have your business card and you align your business card so that the, the card scanner captures the card as much as possible. And from there, of course, what it's going to do from then, do there is just it's going to OCR and pull as much of the information as possible. Then it's going to ask you to verify that the information that is captured is correct, right? So now we have person's name, uh, title, uh, even the email isn't on the card, so it did not pick up the email address. And I'll actually leave that off uh, for privacy reasons, uh, mobile number, and of course, the website. Right now, there's something here that I need to adjust, but I'll show you guys how you can do that after. So you go to next, and I can come right here, and I can adjust the website, right? Because it's going to just be looking to see exactly as to where the, right? So I can actually now just go back in, and I can say it is trinidad.hytt.com. All right, click done. And if I need to put in the person's email, what you do is just you just go here and you type in the person's email based upon the information that you actually have. From there, you click save and you save the contact. And here, you now have this person's name right in your contact record. And the good thing in there is too, is that more than likely, this would have actually based upon how the customer's email is set up to the organization that they would have been working with, it's actually now there's an association between the company. So if I am now looking, so I now have a contact and a company created directly in the CRM, right? So when I go back here, I will have Hyatt now being a company. And of course I have the customer's name as being a new contact created today. And that's it. That is how simple it is when it is that you are looking at getting a business card from someone. We don't want to be collecting stacks of business cards anymore. You can actually you now just accept that business card, scan it straight into CRM. And it's a very, very intuitive tool uh, to the point where even if there are one or two errors, you can actually just go back in and fix the errors. And of course, just give the person back the business card because we know that you're not going to be using it. All right. So I hope that this tip was actually helpful for you, especially when it is that you're using HubSpot. As I've said before, HubSpot is one of the easiest CRMs that I have used. It's extremely intuitive. Let me know if it is that you need to get any information or insight or tips. And for those of you who want to get more information about as to which CRM is maybe the best tool for you, feel free to reach out to me at your earliest convenience. Take care, guys. Peace.